Anyway, somebody told me there's a new Mexican restaurant in town just opened and it's I don't, it's so new I don't even know the name of it it's not on Google yet um, but I know where it is so they gave me the directions I'm going there right now to check it out and there's a rumor they might have some burrito tacos so we'll go check it out and try to get some of those tacos hopefully I don't know maybe we'll order something different but the bottom line is uh, we're checking out a new place so new that Google doesn't even list it yet. What's the name of it? Los Dos Rancheros. Okay guys, so we are basically going to where it says fireworks warehouse. Somewhere over here, we're not sure where. But somewhere over here. Oh, oh wait a minute. Stop, stop, stop. Is that, that's not it, is it? That truck, is that, is that little truck? I think that was it. That little taco truck. This isn't a restaurant. You have arrived at your destination. Yeah, yeah, that was it, I think. Um, that's it. There we go. Yay. Don't get me wrong, I love taco trucks. Okay guys, we're just kind of cruising on up here and looks like they're open. They ooh. Oh, they got a nice selection. They got steak and chicken and Spicy pork and barbecue beef. So, seems pretty good. I'm gonna see what they got here. Oh, Berea case uh, tacos right there. That's what I'm gonna order. Wow, they got a bunch of dinners. Let's, uh, you wanna split a burrito and try it? Okay guys, so anyway, it looks like uh, they're putting an order together and we will meet you back at the house to take a look at everything close up. Um, their credit card machine, ooh, wasn't working. So we paid cash. So anyway, um, to bring some cash, you have to come by just in case somehow the machine breaks again. So anyway. All right, guys. So first I got to taste the meat because what I've been told is the original burrito tacos use, I think, goat's meat. I don't know. I'm just being told these things. Mm-hmm. It tastes like beef. All right. So if you look right here, see that juice right there? You just dunk. It's like that. Dunk, dunk, dunk. And come up. Mmm. Mmm. Look how big that burrito is. It's huge. Anyway. Give that a try. Okay guys, so I'm sitting here editing Los Dos Rancheros video and I tried the burrito and then that was it. There was no other footage and I'm like, I didn't grade it. I didn't review it at the ending or not. I was supposed to do it on the way home. Let me go look. Hold on a minute, let me go check. I may have done it and not transferred it from my phone. Hold on. It seems like I did not do an ending to this video. So I would have gave this place a perfect score, but unfortunately the burrito tacos were amazing. The it's juice I dipped it in was amazing, but unfortunately the, the burritos aren't worth it. They're packed, they're huge because all you get is beans and rice. I don't even know if to put meat in my burrito. I literally tasted no meat. That, that bugs me. I always order my burritos with no rice and no beans, and I didn't do it that time, and that's why I order it with no rice and no beans, because they give you 20 pounds of filler. So anyway, that was a little bit of a bummer. If anybody from that place is watching this, um, or if you ever go there, request no rice, no beans, and see what kind of a burrito they put out. But uh, it was loaded, but loaded with a bunch of stuff that I don't like. But anyway, uh, that's my personal preference. That's why I order it. You know, my, the Mexican place I go to has an amazing burrito with no rice and no beans that just loaded with meat. So anyway, that was a little downfall right there. So we were going to do an A+, plus, but then after the burrito, we're probably dropping it to a B+. Plus. So uh, the place is well worth it. Bring your cash because that, that cash, that credit card machine breaks all the time. 
and they seem to always be just taking cash. So I'm just teasing, but um, have fun with it. Uh, show them some love. You know, they're, they're trying to make something out of themselves in that parking lot. And I love supporting those taco trucks. I love it. Reminds me of back in Cali. So anyway, you guys take care. And I apologize. I didn't do the ending, but I have now. All right. So once again, congratulations to Los Dos Rancheros.